Welcome everyone. So today we are going to understand how to find the value of a plus b when they have given us a cube minus b cube equals to 61 and they have also told us that a and b both of them are natural numbers. So here let's, un let's try and do the expansion of a cube minus b cube. So here I can say a minus b the whole gets multiplied to a square plus a b plus b square equals to 61. That's it. After this, I am stuck. I am not able to do much. So, since on your left hand side, I can't do much. What I can do is let's try and find factors of 61. But now 61 is also what? A prime number. So, you can get either 1 into 61 or 61 into 1. Now, please understand. If you look at this bracket, here you have a minus b. Okay. And this bracket is completely added. Okay, so I know that this value a minus b has to be smaller than a square plus a b plus b square. So from here I can say therefore a minus b value will be what 1. And I can also say that a square plus a b plus b square equals to 61. Okay. So here I can say from this point that a equals to 1 plus b. Now putting this value of a over here we will get 1 plus b the whole square plus 1 plus b multiplied by b plus b square equals to 61. Now using the expansion of a plus b the whole square I will get 1 plus 2b plus b square and multiplying b with this entire bracket I get b plus b square and this plus b square is left so that also will get added. Now if you look closely let's add the b squares I will be left with 3b square plus 3b and we'll subtract 1 on the other side. So, we'll be left with what? Just 6b. Now, let's divide everything by 3. You will get b square plus, th sorry, just single b. And this will now equal to what? 20. Let's shift it on this side. I'll get b square plus b minus 20 equals to 0. Now the factors for this one, this quadratic equation should be what? Plus 5 minus 4 plus 5b minus 4b minus 20 equals to 0. So I will have b plus 5 or b minus 4 equals to 0. Now value of b can either be what? Minus 5 or it will be plus 4. Now this has to be rejected because both of them are belonging to what natural numbers so b value is just what 4 so a value will be what a is 1 plus b so a value is 5 so from here i can say a plus b that is what 5 plus 4 that gets you what 9 9 is the answer for this particular question so i hope you've understood how to solve these kind of looking Questions. The trick is to try to factorize your number when you are stuck with your variables. Okay. So that's it for today. I will definitely see you in the next video.